What is up YouTube, it's your boy AG and we back with another video. So this one is gonna be very interesting. I told y'all about my cousin. For those of you who follow me on TikTok, I go live a lot and I explain, you know, the situation with my cousin. Um, you know, he's about a year or two younger than me. We grew up together. Um, you know, we both went to separate colleges and, you know, I ended up graduating and I'm just now getting back home. And uh, when he went to college, I think his second year, sophomore year, he went through a situation where it changed his life forever. And, um, you know, it really just took a toll on his life and it changed everything for him. So, you know, he's been, you know, homeless um, countless amount of times. Uh, he's just trying to find his way. You know, he's still very young and his mind is kind of, you know, altered from everything. But um, ultimately, you know, we're happy that he's still here and, you know, still living. So now that I'm back, I'm going to find him. Uh, I am in Lincoln, Nebraska right now. It's an hour away from Omaha. And I'm looking for him down in Lincoln. When I find him, um, I'm gonna show you guys, you know, what he looks like. You know, y'all get to hear him talk. And um, yeah, man, he's a very intelligent guy. You know, he just got himself in a situation that was very unfortunate. You know, you guys be careful with who y'all uh, smoking with, who y'all, you know, doing these activities with. You gotta be with people that y'all trust because not everybody is there, you know, in your best interest. So, you know, this is a lesson to not only me, but everybody watching. And I just wanna let y'all know that um, no matter what you go through, man, as long as you live and you got a chance and I'm gonna make sure that I give him the best advice I can and try to get him back, you know, uh, together so we're gonna go work out we're gonna get him a haircut we're gonna get him clothes and all that stuff food and uh yeah just catch up so i will see you guys when i find him there is good vlog man see found him hey what's up yes, you work here uh no i work at city uh, yeah. you ready to go no yeah. yeah. How you been? What's up? Boy, I've been working out. You've been working out. This is my cousin, man. Hey, what's up? Down here in Lincoln. Yeah, bro. Stay in Lincoln. Yeah, yeah. That's crazy. Been a minute. Yeah. Yeah, here it Yeah, I was just telling him, I was like, we're going to get you right. Get down there, get clothes, haircut, food, everything. Where? So you got a job and everything? Yeah, yeah, I, I got a telemarketing job. Okay, that's what's up. So wait, when do you got to be back to work? Uh, Probably like Monday. We, we get to make our own hours, so. Oh, okay, that's what's up. I'm glad you're making, making a living out here for y'all, sir. You know what I'm Yeah. That's what's up. Well, y'all, I found them. So we about to go back to the car. We're going to get back to Omaha. Um, his dad is having birthday. Uh, birthday coming up. 62 years old, his father's turning. So we're gonna celebrate that. And uh, yeah, we'll let y'all know what we do next. We're gonna chop it up, catch up a little bit. And uh, yeah, we'll talk to y'all when we figure out what we're gonna do next. Yes, sir. Good to meet y'all. <laughs> All right, guys, we are back at the crib. It's been a long drive finally back it's been a long day in general but um yeah we just got back uh so basically i just bought him some food you know bought him some stuff to clean himself up so he's taking a shower right now and we're going to basically have like a little mukbang talk you know catch up on on cam ask him a few questions you know just to see where his head at and um yeah so hopefully y'all enjoy that um i'm gonna try to get him a haircut and all that stuff tomorrow and yeah man that'll be it for the video just wanted y'all to see um you know my cousin meet him you know he really important to me because he my family like my brother i grew up with him we talked about all the stuff he like my brother you know i grew up with him we talked about all the stuff that we wanted to do when we got older you know unfortunately things didn't go as planned on his end but um, that doesn't mean that, you know, life is over and it doesn't mean that he can't still, you know, achieve those goals. So we're going to talk to him. Um, yeah, and just eat, chill, you know, vibe it out. 
and uh, that's pretty much what the video is gonna be about. So we finally decided what we was gonna do tonight. He's gonna chill. Um, I got pizza um, and with some wine. So we just gonna, you know, sit, talk it up a little bit, Absolutely. catch up, and uh, yeah, it's pretty much gonna be like a little mukbang. So I know y'all heard of that. You know, you eat, talk, and stuff. So that's what we gonna do. You wanna? You start well, off with telling me a little story. For all those that do not know, my name is Leon Gordon. Speak a little louder. So for all those that do not know, my name is Leon Gordon. Uh, me and Alan are first cousins. Uh, from Omaha, Nebraska. Uh, really born and raised. Went to uh, went to college at you don't know for a couple of years. Got into some trouble. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Explain that. Well, just to make a long story short. Well, I got. I, I ain't even gonna lie. It's. I hit the blunt a couple times. I think somebody might have laced me. I ain't even gonna. Got to be careful. It's, it's it's basically legal in Nebraska, but you do have to be careful who you buy your weed from. Uh, didn't get around to completing my summer classes. Got into some debt and. Essentially, essentially that was no go for me. So, so fortunately, I'm broke. Did have to pay pay off my loan. So, ended up having to having to take the poverty route. So, here I am saving up money, trying to get my life back in order. So. How you feel from the time you know all that happened to now? Man, like it was just there. disappointing. Oh, and I got shot. I got shot by some random moron. I got I got shot in my foot and I got shot right right about here. I survived, so so I'm good. Back into sports or lifting and calisthenics. So how do you feel like when all that stuff happened versus now? Like, what is your mindset going forward? My mindset is uh basically to stay focused um you know uh drive initiative Re really really all all that that comes comes with that you know so so that's that's the goal what's up how you feel about me being back i'm 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 really glad you back i ain't gonna lie it's kind of it's a, it's a little bit boring here i mean i do I do got friends and stuff I, I visit, but but ain't nothing like family though. Right. Like past two years was kind of hard. I ain't gonna lie, it was bullshit, bullshit. Past two years was hard. Yeah, it's hard for me too, cause just knowing everything that's going on, me being in college, having to stay focused, and knowing that I got family back home that's going through you know struggles and stuff that I know I could be there for, but like physically just couldn't be there. Like that's a tough situation to be in. Hell yeah. But, uh, I knew, you know, if I just stayed focused, I would get to this point, you know, graduate and eventually I'll be back home and I'll be able to, you know, come in and find you and get you right. You know, I do every time I come back, every time I came yeah. back. I'm I'm honestly glad to be alive. It, <laughs> I'm honest. I, honestly, I am glad to be alive. OK, like like I damn I could have got killed. Uh, I'm not the dumbest person in the world. I actually run an online um ancestry research business uh I've, I've, I've traced clients back before don't really matter what race you are if you are paying i will research your ancestry uh or uh anybody that might just want to contact me just to say hello especially females you can <laughs> you can definitely contact me on instagram mental underscore abolitionist please do uh, uh, Tell them some of the stuff that you're interested in. I'm interested in. I, I, first, first off, I was a horticulture student, so plants, uh, uh, farming, anything to do with 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 uh, growing your own, you know, growing your own food and stuff like that. So I am interested in, in plants. If you like flowers, plants, uh, uh, take up an interest in that. That's type of stuff that I'm into. So, so yeah. Very very intelligent man. You know, just in an unfortunate situation. And that's why I'm trying to get him back, you know, together. He already got it going on. He got his own job. Yeah. Um, yeah making I'm... his own money. So, 
you know, situation is not the best, but he's making the, the most of, you know, the situation. So proud of him for that. Yeah. You know, now that I'm back, you know, I can make sure he's still on track and keep moving forward. So, yeah, man, I'm proud of you. You know, we're going we gonna to get right. We're going to start getting in the gym. Exactly. Start, you know, finding some other opportunities for you. So, so it's going to get better together. I hope, you know, y'all are here to tune in to uh, my road to to muscle building so <laughs> my road to success so yeah you want to get into um you know lifting and stuff yeah i'm aiming so, to be 185 pounds so that's right on my lane you know i can help with that but um yeah man it was nice chopping it up with you proud of you um so going forward you know tomorrow we may try to go get some haircuts. It may be hard because we don't. I don't have a, a designated barber here, so we're gonna have to go barber hopping. Hopefully, they don't mess us up. But you know, we'll try to make sure we find the right person. Um, try to get us some haircut. You know, get dressed. Uh, probably go out. You know, have some fun, and then um, you know, we're gonna end it off with celebrating his dad's birthday. Yeah, yeah. my pop. Yeah, his birthday. Mm -hmm. So yeah. So yeah. Keep moving forward from there, man. Absolutely. But yeah, appreciate y'all for watching. You know, I hope y'all got something from this. You know, make sure you you with people that can be trusted. Um, you know, think about things before you do. Moral of the lesson: Don't do drugs, uh, even marijuana. Yeah, so. I mean that's a very important <laughs> tip too. If you don't want to deal with none of that, yeah, you know, don't do just, drugs. But if you are and you happen to do so, you know, just make sure you're around people that you can trust. Uh, you know, for the kids, even teenagers adults watching you know we can all learn from the situation i learned from his situation and try to yeah. make sure i handle things the best way possible but you know that's why i wanted y'all to meet him because he's been through a lot uh throughout his life more than what he just explained right now you know so only the people that's closer to him know but the only thing i'm worried about is you know him persevering and, and being happy and having some success so that's the goal um Hope y'all enjoyed the video. We're going to try to make some more videos soon. Uh, maybe some fitness stuff because that's what he likes to do. So Yeah, I'm I'm working on it. I'm working on it. Yeah. So, my yeah. arms need more shape to them. Right, right. We're going to mold something out of this. So <laughs> Yeah, we're going to get you right. What's up, guys? Um, After the month here, you know me and Leon drank some wine, drank to the court. This is his first time having to court, you know, I'm gonna show y'all, you know, what he did to him. So, he is. Out. Out on the floor. I'm gonna wake him up because I just cleared the bed off so he can get in the bed. But as you can see, the Taylor Port has put that man to sleep. He had fun though, you know. I'm happy he enjoyed himself. Um, the live was great. You know, we had a great conversation. It was very funny. See him, you know, express himself and you know, just have fun. But yeah, I'm going to sleep as well. Um, tomorrow we're gonna to try to go get some haircuts and uh dress up a little bit and maybe take some flicks. But yeah, that's it for tonight. I will see you guys tomorrow. What is up, YouTube? We are in the bathroom right now. See my man Leon got the haircut, but we can do a little styling. You know, we gotta hit him with a curl sponge. Uh, you know, get him looking a little sharper. So that's what we're doing now. Show y'all a little bit. <coughs> a little bit of what's going on. First you gotta see his hair is very thick, very thick and matted. So we're gonna start by picking it up. It's gonna be a lot of hair all over the place. That boy got some thick hair. Crazy. You could definitely get braids if you wanted to. Yeah. You ain't ever thought about growing dreads? Yeah. I had them, but but I got I got rid of my dreads. Yeah, I got rid of them. They just. I'm talking about growing them again because it's like it seemed like it'd be easy, an easy cut for you. Or yeah. First for you because you don't be. Messing with your hair too much. If you ever look at my social media, you'll see that uh, I used to have dreads. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Damn it. 
Oh, okay. You should call me early. We could go eat at the seafood, but nah. I really want to try that though. All right, I'm gonna stay there real quick. All right, guys, we are done with the styling. See how my guy looking? Yes, sir. Give me a side view. How you feel? I feel amazing. I feel amazing. You got my boy right. So now, you know, we're gonna get dressed. I'm gonna find him something to wear. And, uh, you know, we're just gonna go out and have some fun. Uh, probably take some pictures and stuff. So, yeah, man. This will be close to the end of the video. Um, all there is left to do is, you know, go turn up a little bit, have a little fun. Absolutely. Got my man looking nice. Got to get him a fig going. But, uh, yeah, I feel like this yeah. is the end of the video, you know. Uh, I'm pretty much not going to be to show you guys what we do after this. I just want to show you guys the process of me finding him, you know, what we did. You know, conversation, where we at now, where we're going forward. So, you know, keep on going forward, man. You know, I got you. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. Yeah. This is the end of the video. I hope y'all enjoyed the video. This is my cousin Leon once again. Um, I'm not sure if he uses social media. Uh, I do. Uh, oh, I'm on Instagram as mental underscore abolitionist. Okay. Mental underscore abolitionist. Abolitionist, like Frederick Douglass. Got you, got you. All right, well, y'all know where to find this, man. Thank you for watching, and I'll see y'all in the next one. All right, thanks.